people have bad races and we can joke about it and people have good races and we can celebrate it. So it's just like, it's just a nice thing to be around. And I'm, I would think I obviously have like the capability to get some more top results this season, but I, I think I'm just like in such a good place to enjoy it and like savor Minneapolis moment and just like keep skiing well because of being relaxed and in a good place. And I'm, yeah super happy with that uh, now it feels like my body is in a really stable place where like i i know i've tested a couple things obviously in the last few years and have a better idea of like what type of training balance between in intensity volume strength races to do and have a lot of great coaches around me so that's like that's been a much smoother process lately and i feel very confident in it right now which is fun what people don't see from other countries especially is how this is happening in my opinion this is happening to a great extent because our clubs and our regional communities have gotten so strong our coaches are really good we've got many many juniors training really hard and um it, this isn't a coincidence we got more medals than we've ever gotten in u23s and world juniors someone told me the other day and i i absolutely adhere to this Always be a student, sometimes a teacher, never an expert. <laughs> well, when you, the second you start considering yourself an expert, you stop learning. And I know that's where Gus and, and the rest of his teammates are at. They're, they're always learning. They're hungry for more. And they're always looking at the ways to see things in different, from different perspectives and different solutions. And they're in a good place. And uh, I'm very confident that they'll keep enjoying themselves on their way to the top as well as excelling and representing us very well.